Hello, Trev here. I'm just doing um, an unboxing and review of a thumb brace. Mary, do you want to say hello? I'm going to help me unwrap it. So, um, a thumb brace. So basically, I've been getting a sore thumb. Um, I thought it was from a bike, and um, you can see this. But it hurts sort of when I play guitar. So I've been looking at this. I went for a massage with um, a friend who lives near nearby, and she recommended this sort of thing. So I'm just going to have a go. Looks very, very small. This is about £10 from Amazon. There were a few different sorts. Um, what do you think, Romeo? Quite, quite flimsy. So I'm not sure if it's going to provide much support. And I've got the medium size. Okay, so that's probably Romeo just stopped. <laughs> Romeo just stopped the recording. <laughs> um, so that's probably the right size for um, for me. Uh, let's just have a look if I see if I can adjust it. So, how's that look? Providing a bit of support around there. Let's just have a little look at the picture. Does that look right? Ah, no, I've got it the wrong way around. So it should be on the wrist, more like this. So maybe I've got it the wrong. Yes, I've got it on the wrong hand. Okay, uh, that makes more sense. Okay, so it's more like this. Okay. Yeah, definitely the right size. So if you're going for sizing, um, I would say my hands are sort of medium, medium sort of size. I've not got the biggest hands, but I certainly thought about getting large, but I actually got a medium size and this this has kind of worked out, I think. So I read the reviews on the Amazon um, site and some people were saying the large was a bit too loose. So how's that? Yeah, and it's just supporting the joint. I will put the link to this in the um, descriptions. Um, yeah, it seems to provide, provide some support. Let's see if it actually works with playing. So when I'm doing my bar chords, um, as you see, you shouldn't really put much pressure on your thumb. It's probably, historically, I've just played a little bit um, badly. You should be pulling more into the into the, into the the side of the neck. But, um, yeah, I think I might wear that in practice. Don't really need that one so much, because obviously I'll be um, holding a plexum or whatever. Also, with piano, the stretch, uh, if I was doing, say, octaves or whatever... Um, interesting to see how it works this one was pretty good let me just look up the exact um, um, sort of description of what this one is um, welcome thumb support brace layer uh, two-piece soft elastic thumb compression sleeve um, so yeah so this one um, was let me just see eight pounds 99 there were cheaper ones um, I would say if you if you go for a cheaper one, uh, again looking at the reviews, they were um, were not <laughs> not very favourable. So I would say sort of you're looking for a ten pound sort of or a little bit less um, purchase. There are some very um, expensive ones as well, so you can go up to forty or fifty pounds. But I think that's enough support. I've got all of my motion. I'm pretty sure I could practice. Um, my instruments um, pretty well and hopefully that might take some of the, the pressure off my thumb and sort of see if in practice I don't overuse that um, and protect it so yeah see if you can see um, will welcome see you soon bye